This yo is, I think, not doing great. She's lying here with her bag. And this means that there's a lamb coming out. I've just popped it to get it out of the way. She's just lying here doing nothing. So I'm gonna go in and see what's up, if she'll let me. Aha, there is a foot, okay. observing and learning. Okay, one foot, two foot. Pat a girl. Come on, push. 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 Pat a girl. Push. Now, problem is the hoof is coming out backwards. When a hoof comes out backwards, that means that we might have to do some resuscitation because when the umbilical cord breaks, the lamb will inhale inside and it'll inhale, its first breath will be its birthing fluids. Uh oh, uh oh, okay, I see the problem. We have two lambs coming out at once. One is coming out backwards. That's a backward hoof. You want the hoof pointing the other way around. So I've got to push this back in and pull out the other lamb. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, so two are trying to come out at once. Okay, push that back in. And let's see if I can get, where's your head? Okay. Oh. Okay, see that hoof is coming out the correct way. Oh, no, it's not. Dang. Got the wrong hoof. Okay. Okay, let's see. That's one hawk. That's a forward hoof. Oh, doing all this blind. Ah, oh, bugger it. Ah, oh, Bugger it. Okay. I'm going to have to put that there and see if I can. Uh, push that back in. Now. Dang. Okay, that's one front foot. Might have to just pull two back feet out. Oh, you're a real tangle now. Oh dear. Ah, oh, fuck it. <sighs> Three legs. Oh, man. Okay, that is forward. That is forward. Okay, so those are the two that I want to pull out. And 
and this one I want to put in. head okay there's your head come here you little bugger come on Where is your head? <laughs> Where is your bloody head? Oh, there it is. Come on. Ah. Oh, God, we're going to be lucky if any of these are alive. Oh, come on. Come on. Come 
on. Come on. Oh. Oh. Come on. Get up. Come on. Okay. Okay. I think this one is just alive. It's breathing. Now I've got to go in. There, panting. Good baby. That's it. You're alive. Okay. Now, got to see if I can get the second one or not. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the second one. I mean, I don't know if I'm going to get the second one alive. Okay, two back legs. Okay. Oh! This one might be dead because of the complications of me fishing. Ugh, come on. Ugh, ugh, ugh. No, you might be dead. Yeah, I think there's no life in you. Ah, uh, no, stay. Let me see if there's anything else in you. Up, oh, there's another one. Okay. Oh! This one better come out. Right. Oh, yes. Hopefully, you're alive. You are alive. Okay. Okay. Come on. Don't be floppy. Don't be like your other one. Oh. 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 There we go. Okay. There's two. Two alive. And the one that was coming backwards dead. Oh, Lord. Come on. She's got the shakes and the shivers. So, one dead and two alive. Now I've got to get the mother. She's, she's shook up, very shook up. That was a hard birth. So the mother's made it back to her two young that are alive. Normally I'd immediately put her in one of my lambing pens, but I want her, because it was such a tough birth, I want her to take care of them right there for the moment. And there's not very many Yes, left. There's one, two, three, I think four. So there's four left. So I'll just take the dead one away and leave her with uh, the two live ones. I'm also going to get her, give her some U Reviver because uh, that was a tough one. Yeah, good girl. They're both alive. Sadly, I lost that one, but it was this one's hind legs were coming out with the front legs of that one. So it was the combination of them getting tangled up and probably the umbilical cord of this lamb when I was sorting it out, pushing him back in, that I probably broke the umbilical cord of this one. 
And so he inhaled inside, uh, which would have been a whole lot of fluid. So he probably died before I had a chance to get him out. But at least we have two that are alive. So I'm gonna get her uh -huh. some Reviver, Yo Reviver, and put that one with the other dead lambs. But that's the important part right there, the life. Uh -huh. And that she's now bonding with them, which is good. Uh -huh. Sometimes after a rough birth, the Yo won't bond with her lambs. So this is very important. Uh -huh. Luckily, I have this setup going because the mains are off. But I have the wash basin and the jug, big bin full of water, and then this is the soap. This is for visitors and anybody who comes. Is They wash their hands when they arrive and they wash their hands before they leave. And this is since the Corvo 19 uh, thing epidemic happening at the moment. So after birthing the lamb just now, I had to wash my hands by delving it, water into that and then washing it with that. And then I have a setup here. This is what I've done for the paper towel is right here. Kind of primitive. It's right where the fire extinguisher is, but uh, it'll, it does the job. So that's, uh, we're routinely getting our mains turned off because they're working on them and stuff. So this is, um, my, luckily I have this set up uh, in preparedness for when the mains get switched off so I can wash the blood and birthing goop off of my arms. So here's the yo uh, that had the difficult birth. Both lambs are got their heads up. I've just given her some uh, multi lamb. Horses are all interested. That's Grasshopper and Marco Polo. And they're hearing the munch of food. So they think it's supper time, but it's not. Hours away there, Marco Polo. So giving her some strength to look after her lambs because she's a little bit shook. And everybody else here is thinking that it's their turn as well. So I've got one, two, three Zwartblas left to lamb. So these are the lambs. And that's a girl. And this is another girl. So two little girls. And they'll be getting up and eating, drinking from their mother soon, I hope. So she has water over there and hay here. So I think she'll be, this is a, she's a first time mother. So here's, fingers crossed, all goes well. So it was triplets, but twins are just, uh, living twins are just as good as triplets. And they're nice little babies. Yes. Yes. No, you're not getting any. Sorry, Marco Polo. Hello, Grasshopper. No, you're not getting either, any either. Sorry. It's all for her. 